the move command and object snap using AutoCAD 2013 educational version. In this tutorial we are going to move the rectangles into place to create a chain link. The command is move that I'm typing in. Okay, Then it's going to ask me to select my objects. So a couple ways to select. I can left mouse click and go from right to left and that will click or highlight any lines that I touch. I can individually click on lines to highlight them or I can go from left to right with a window and highlight everything. Now I'm going to right mouse click. Now it's going to ask me to specify the base point. When I do this, I'm going to zoom in a tiny bit, you will see that different little um, either boxes or rectangles are showing up in this instance. This is called object snap. When I go to the bottom here, you're going to find one called object snap and it will be somewhere on your screen. Okay, and I'm going to right mouse click and go settings. In here you can see that endpoint and midpoint are selected. If I unclick the midpoint and click on OK, you will now see that the only time it snaps is when I get close to an endpoint and you can see how it is there. Okay? If you do not like object snap, what you can do is simply toggle it on or off. And now you can see that there is no object snap happening. Okay? And I'm just relying specifically on the grid and my snap that I set up earlier to make this move. So I'm going to turn it back on and I'm going to click on the corner and now I'm going to move this down into place. There's my first one in place. I'm going to zoom out, scroll out a tiny bit. I'm going to highlight my next one, hit the space bar to bring back the last command and click my reference and I'm going to put it there and once again I'm going to highlight this way and hit the space bar to bring back the last command and put that into place there. That is the move command and object snap.